of the uh, assistant co-author who has gotten shot. There is some response to you. I think I'll take the service purpose in two respects. One, whacking your appetite and shocking you back. Oh, this is something new. It's a triggering some controversial constant okay. That is uh, well done. Uh, in terms of pragmatic capability of implementing this system, that's far too well, obviously. But at least we weigh the issue. This is up to the goal of one organization, or at least a transitional comes tag in one, what transaction denominated in one rather than other major policy makes sense. Now, ultimately, that will serve the purpose dually and mutually between North Korea and South Korea. Let me digress a little bit. If you make a poll in South, South Korea and ask the people, we all know unification is our dream. Yes, we want unification. That's our dream. Now then ask, who would want unification right now? Nobody. Just like the question by Pastor, who wants to go to heaven right now? Almost the same. Because the cost of unification is so huge. Therefore, in a sense for the South Korea, I know many South Koreans, including that cost uses raised by the Bank of America official, but the cost is minimal. If we consider long-term cost of affiliated and associated with unification, that price we have to pay maybe by South Korean in order to save ultimate huge cost of unification. This is an at least interesting or some suggestible suggestion to North Korea. That's one thing. Uh, the other thing is and uh, the ideology and all those, that's a major stuff in blood, of course, that wouldn't budge. But again, as suggested by Dr. Chang, previously impossible thing can happen overnight. The European monetary system is one thing, and another good example is who would ever believe the typical the communist regime in China would ever adopt capitalist society if we have not had Tung Xiaoping. So we would dream that there would be some another Kim Sharping successor after Kim Jong-il, or at least is some kind of similar or immutable new leader at least, accepting this idea. And why not? Then it will really indirectly and gradually promote peace in that part of the world. Once again, thank you very much. Next time, uh, I have to submit the review of paper. Please accept the paper. Uh, <laughs> well, uh, as uh, Dr. John mentioned, this is a topic he's very invested in and will do uh, a lot of further work on. So I thank you all for coming and contributing to that process. Uh, and let's uh, thank Dr. John for his cooperation.